Good morning, everyone. So this week we're going to be looking at something that both Dad and I are very, very passionate about, which is the side lever. In this case, we are going to be looking at this beautiful Stephen Grant. I was brought up shooting a side lever, a Holland Royal, which if you ask me, it's mine. If you ask Dad, it's his. Um, but nevertheless, it is something that both of us are extremely passionate about. And really, really looking forward to this one. So here we have it guys, our beautiful Stephen Grant side lever, made in 1894 for a HR Bird Esquire. This is a best London bar action with typical Grant side lever opening and their hallmark fluted fences. It is absolutely stunning. So the gun was ordered as a pair with two foot six inch barrels. However, this one was re-barreled by Grant in 1966 with two and a half inch chambered 28 inch barrels, choked quarter and improved cylinder. The gun comes in at six pound 12 ounces with a beautifully highly figured 15 inch stock. And it is a corker. Have a look at that. Oh. So, shoots very flat for myself, just about the right amount of cast. Um, comes up absolutely lovely. A Little bit long in the stock for myself, obviously I can adjust that by moving the hand back. So this particular gun, we have sold it before. Dad has renovated it and rebuilt it a long time ago. Um, even he can't remember. Um, and we have serviced it throughout the years with its previous owner. So it's quite nice that it's come back to us to be sold. So we're gonna head out, have a bash with it, see how we get on and we'll come back. Morning everyone. So back at Brandon Wood again, we're going to have a go around the 50 Sporting again. I've got some Compex 21 fiber wads. Obviously, I'm not going to smash anything heavy through this. Nice and light. Beautiful day. It's really sunny, really nice. Um, so yeah, really looking forward to getting out with this. Beautiful weather and yeah, should be really, really nice and enjoyable. Obviously, I love shooting side by side. So I am really looking forward to this. Obviously, as I said earlier, I do have a Holland Royal side lever. So this is a bit like home for me. But yeah, really looking forward to it. Shot cam's on, so we'll get some footage for you, and let's go. I don't mind a bit of heckling in it. It always uh, makes it look good. Oh. And it's got two bloody triggers. Oh. Morning. Oh. Killed the first one perfectly. I think this is this nice driven one. Oh, it's, it's, oh, it's, wow, what's oh, wrong with this? I oh, I like driven stuff. I'm hoping it won't be a Oh, that's nasty, that's curly. Oh. <laughs> that first and right. Shoot it nice and early. Just. Flick barrel as you get to the back of it, okay. 
kill it out there rather than up there. What you're doing is you're slowing. So the first one you kill there, the second one you try to shoot it here. Shoot the fucker out there. Oh! Designed for me with my side lever in the ground. Well, oh. so we've just finished our round, so we've shot the fifty today. I mean. Thoroughly enjoyed it, not just shooting this, but we've had a group of six of us here today, which just makes shooting so much fun. We've had a really, really good time. The weather is absolutely beautiful today. Um, it's 16, 17 degrees, and being out here with this, just it's been fantastic. It's really, really enjoyed it. Uh, I know I keep saying that, but I have done it. I mean, I'm really, really passionate about this stuff, and obviously it's bought up shooting a Holland Royal side lever. So this, to me, it's just been like, going back to my youth I sound like an old man now but <laughs> it really has it, it just brings back so many fond memories of shooting with dad uh, I mean I shot my first ever pheasant with a side lever so having the chance to shoot something like this again has been been really 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 enjoyable um, and it is a really pretty gun I mean here in the sunshine obviously that's nice and shiny shall we say um, but yeah right head back to the shop guys and we'll finish off there so I know I rambled on a bit about how much I enjoy myself and I think sometimes when you're in this industry and you do what we do when you're involved in around guns every day you, you forget really about what it's there for um, and just the pleasure and enjoyment at sort of being in a group of friends and enjoying yourself in what was a beautiful weather at a great clay ground that's set up really nicely with this and I mean, sometimes I think a lot of us focus on this and forget about what it's really all about. But nevertheless, what a beautiful gun. As I said, I really enjoyed shooting this video because it brings back such fond memories for me. Um, as I said, I was brought up shooting a side lever and dad is so, so passionate about side lever guns. Anyone that knows him will know that his collection is full of them. And it, it really did bring back some fond memories for me. It was very, very sort of reminiscent um and yeah just what a what a fantastic way to spend my sunday um with a group of good friends beautiful weather and that i just such an incredible day and yeah i mean again obviously everybody that knows us will know that dad has built a business around english guns and that's where obviously our website name comes from and that has what we've specialized in for 50 years so it's always nice to go back to our roots and use a gun that you know it's it, again like we said earlier this is a gun that dad's renovated himself we sold to the previous customer um and we've serviced it and looked after it for a number of years so it's always nice to be able to get hands on something again that we've you know we've sold in the past we've serviced, we've renovated, we've looked after, and then, you know, for me to be able to take it on and shoot it is, it's just, yeah, it, it's fantastic because it it just follows on from everything that, that dad has spent 50 years building a business around. Um, so enough rambling, let's talk about the gun. Um, obviously the gentleman that previously owned this gun, uh, we have shot together in the past, obviously I've seen him shoot it and uh, yeah, it's such a beautiful gun. It catches everybody's eye. I mean, when we walked around, we got stopped a couple of times and asked what it was. And just beautiful, beautiful engraving. Um, that 15 inch stock is just fabulous. And that side lever, I mean, oh, the elegance of that top strap, having no top lever, it just transforms the gun. They're just so elegant and sleek and smooth. Um, yeah just a thing of beauty really and I mean you can see the passion I just yeah yeah it, it puts a smile on your face and that's really what this gun's about and it's just something that 
it would be such a charm to own it, to be able to shoot it and use it. And, you know, it is a usable gun. Uh, yes, okay, it's two and a half inch chambers, but, you know, modern day cartridges now, it's not a problem. There's even steel coming through that's two and a half inch. It's just fantastic. And, I, yeah, I, obviously I'm struggling for words a little bit because I think the passion sort of running through now and I'm, I'm, I'm getting a bit run away with myself and probably have talked utter rubbish for the last couple of minutes, but it's just such a a phenomenal bit of kit and, and it's so well put together. And to think that somebody with a file and a hammer and a chisel made all this, you know, no, no CNC or any of that rubbish going on in well over a hundred years ago, just the engineering that somebody's put into that is absolutely phenomenal. And, you know, one of dad's famous sayings, if guns could talk, I mean, if this thing could tell you on some of the shoots it's been on, I mean, I'm sure it's been to some incredible places and handled by some incredible people. And yeah, just the history behind the gun, the engineering, and that it's still here and in that condition at well over 100 years old. I mean, if I look that good at 130 odd years old, I'd be well happy. I think the rest of us was. So thank you for watching, guys. Um, really enjoy this one. And yeah, look forward to seeing you next week. And never know, I might get something modern out or I might get something old. See you next week, guys. Thank you very much.